Greetings, Pokéfans! Michael here, and welcome to the newest episode of my Pokémon Ultra Sun Let's Play walkthrough, my very first journey through these brand new Pokémon games. If you are enjoying the series, don't forget to leave a like, make sure you answer the comment question down below, and if you missed the last episode, make sure you check it out. We had a pretty fun battle against Acerola. Acerola. Whatever the heck her name is, it, I don't even, I still don't know how it's pronounced. It's been over a year, I don't know how her name's pronounced. Um, but we are going to take on the final Elite Four member. Um, who I think it's Kahili? It's totally Kahili. That's the same wing as it was before. This chick who just like, yep, okay, alright. I just want to say though, I think it's hilarious that in this game they made it so you can get the Flying EMZ like way earlier. You don't need the Machan strength. You may remember this from earlier and she just walks up and it's like, the Flying EMZ, here's how you use it. And it's like, were you just standing in the corner like waiting to like give this to me? I wonder if she's going to mention it. I wonder if she's going to say anything about it. Because the Flying EMZ is totally optional. So I don't need to heal my team, but I do want to change the items up um, by name. ICMZ, got that. I want to give that to Ninetales and probably use it on her two cannon, assuming her team is the same. Um, because that is... I, I, I think it's a good strategy to... I think it's a good strategy to... I'm brain farting so hard. It's a good strategy to use your Z-move against the Pokemon of theirs that is going to use their Z-move and like hope you outspeed and one shot so they don't have a chance to do it. Um, what do I want to do? I want to give Incineroar the Expert Belt back. Um, yes, and then I wanted to... Garchomp's holding a Black Glasses. I'm going to give him the Hardstone to boost the power of um, Rock Slide for this battle. I don't think there's anything else I want to change. I could give uh, Vikevolt the Electrium Z, but I don't want to because I like Quick Claw better, and I'm going to use it for a lot of this battle, and it having Quick Claw is going to help it a lot. Um, okay, I think we're good to go. Let's, uh... I'm going to use a Lepaberry on Thunderbolt. It's mostly full, but, like, I have several, and who knows how many I'm going to have to use in this battle. So... Let's, uh, let's do it. Kahili. Interesting that her crystals are green, I wanted to point out. So here you are. Why don't we see who the wind's favor today? You or me? Why is it green? I guess it's kind of like a slightly bluish green. I don't know. It's just flying was always associated with like a light teal blue. And this is way more green. I just think it's interesting that this is the color they gave her. Hello. Hello? Alola! And Alola once again! My name is Kahili. A few years ago, I was a champion of the Island Challenge too, just like you. I've been traveling the world to improve my skill as both a trainer and as a golfer. When I heard that they'd made a Pokemon League in my, home, in my own home region, I came flying back to serve Alola. Have a look at my fantastic flying type team! You know, I think one thing I wanted to put, speaking of flying type teams, uh, Lance is the Dragon Master, but his team is more like, he, it's more like he's a flying type specialist than a, uh, than a Dragon Master, because like his entire team, at least in silver, oh, Braviary, does she have one of those before? Braviary is super slow, but so is Vikable, so we may not actually outspeed this thing. It looks so tiny because of the camera angle with Giant Vikavolt. Um, Lance's team in Silver is like, it's entirely flying type, but only half his team is dragon type, so. The Quick Law! Booyah! All right. One down, four to go. More power for Flurry! Mandibuzz. We will keep battling. I am not concerned about this Mandibuzz. Also pretty sure its physical defense is way higher than its special defense. I don't remember. So she's got the two Unova birds. Ooh. Our defense is high and this is only neutral damage. Okay, see? It's fine. Everything's fine. 
Nice. Way to go, buddy. Okay, Mandibuzz goes down. Watch us the next pecker hole. To Ganon. All right, this is where we're using our ICMZ. I don't know if I've ever actually used ICMZ, so I'm really excited to try this. All right. Let's do it. Sub-Zero Slammer. We got speed! <laughs> I like how I knew the dance, even though no one walked up and told me how to do it. Come on, Flurry, you got this. Sub-Zero Slammer. Whoa! That was awesome! <laughs> that was so cool! <laughs> I love you so much, Flurry! <laughs> oh, good luck, Sahara. Alucha! Let's switch. Because Ion. Let me think. I don't resist the flying. Hmm. I actually think I want to keep Flurry in for this. Wait, does fighting resist ice? Did I just make a mistake? Mold breaker. That's not what mine had. Okay. Oh, it is super effective. Sweet. Do we outspeed though? No, we don't. Oh, and those poison jab? Oh, that wasn't okay. That's fine. If this Oko's. Let's go. Let's go. We've Oko'd her entire team. <laughs> so far. Or a choreo. Oh, but what kind is it? It was a fire one last time. So because of that, I think it's still going to be fire. Because the fire is risky because both Vikevolt and um, Ninetales will reach to that. So let's go for Garchomp and try a Rock Slide. What a choreo. Yep, alright. Still the fire one. Okay, Rock Slide. Please don't miss. Please don't miss. Yes! Alright, there's no- yeah, of course that one shot. It's a freaking- it's four times weak. <laughs> we defeated Elite Four Kahili! It's frustrating to me as a member of the Elite Four, but it seems your strength is the real deal. Also, you might want to consider a more balanced team, because, you know, when you got one type, it kind of makes it a lot easier to beat you, you know? You know, I think you'll bring a breath of fresh air to the Alola battle scene. I was honestly annoyed when Kakui kept pestering me to come here, but I'm glad I did. Cool. Well, you take losing well. All right, let's heal up the squad. Um... Oh my, wrong pocket. Hyper potions? Hyper potion for you too. Does anyone need Lepa Berries? You're good. You're good. You're good. Let's do liquidation just to be safe. I have plenty. You're good. Let's do ice beam just to be safe. Alright, cool. Oh, and I want to change the held items because this next battle is gonna be um how do you say it? Uh not as easy. <laughs> it is going to be, uh... Okay, I want to give you the Never Melt Ice again. Um... Oh, I should have sold that nugget. I want to give... Where is... There it is. I'm going to give you the Soft Sand. You need the Hard Stone. Or Ground Type! Uh, Incineroar, I want to give the Incinium Z. Okay, and then I actually want to take the Z Crystal off of Toxapex, because it's just like, if I'm going to use a Z Crystal, I need to use it on a Pokemon that hits harder. So I think I'm going to give you, I think I saw I had a Poison Barb. 
Yeah. Let's give that to you. Alright, guys. Uh, I'm not gonna do the champion battle right now. I just wanted to, like, get that out of the way because I don't know what's gonna happen when I teleport back. I can't remember if I, like, have to step onto the platform or what. Alright. Just for safety purposes. Okay, I have to step onto the platform before the next thing happens. So, guys... That is where I'm going to call it for this episode. In the next episode, we're going to take on the champion. Um, I feel like it's probably still Kukui, but I can't be certain. Um, who do I want to lead? Oh, it's important to have a... I think it's... I think leading with Incineroar is a good call, just because he's got a solid amount of coverage. Um, and I can't remember what Kukui led with, but... We'll see. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like. Make sure you answer the comment question down below. And that is all I have for now. So until next time, big fans, gotta catch them all!